with seven points after his win. Yeah, solid performances from Glenn Durant and, and especially Peter Wright. That was exceptional. Changed the weight of his darts, changed the length of his stem. We're all thinking, what is he doing? That's another big number, isn't it? It's another big number, Rodney. No, it's another big number. Rod Harrington could spontaneously combust here if he carries on doing that. Double ten. And Anderson's 2-0 down now. And on both legs. Missed big numbers. That will be lightning, won't it? One run out, Fulton! Superb from Anderson to leave, 88. Humphrey's not on a finish, so Anderson back for 88 to break back and level up. Remember, having lost the first two legs, squandering opportunities as he went. Number 14, and still. And 12 down lane, hugely impressive from Gary Anderson, that's the way to do it, bounces back. It would be ironic if one of these, but if MVG did it against Michael Smith after well, Smith taken all the accolades you? last week. One hundred. Luke require one hundred. Rightly so, by the way, it was marvellous. One really magnificent scenes in Dublin. Needs the treble here to leave ball. Now Anderson, which way will he go here? Should be Gary the treble twenty first down, but has other options. Yeah, he's gone twenty twenty for the bullseye. That's bullseye. Oh, that's a long way off. Luke requires well, 65. Luke doesn't want to hit the bullseye going for this 25. Well, two at tops. Only Gary needs the one. Well, that Level the score up at three apiece. Seventh leg, Gary to throw first. Game on. They get nine darts from this 280. Oh, that's a great one switch. Absolutely superb darts. That leaves the 161 that we mentioned that he took out against Gowin Price here a year ago, but that leaves 28 as Anderson finds a fourth maximum in his 17th of the campaign. Deary me, what's happened here? 28. Yes, well, you may wave goodbye to that leg, Luke. There it goes in 14 darts as Anderson's fourth maximum paved the way to a 5 4 advantage. That's the thing about the you know the big power scorers as we call them Anderson, Van Gerwen and Peter Wright. Six starts from here. One run off! Do you know what? I may have just tried to start that treble twenty because it looks so inviting and that extra forty points would have made so much difference. Two double tops. There's one of them. There's the second. Brace of tops. Cool hand, Luke. Red hot on the top of the shop. And that's why he left 100. That's why he went for the 25. It worked that time and a brilliant checkout. And now. For the ball as a safety net, but the safety net has burst open and he's fallen through it. And now Humphreys, 25 for 36. Luke requires 61. Finds the 25, two at double 18, one at double nine. He's botched that twice in the match, that switch. You called it before, Rod. Yeah, it, it's, no one likes that switch. Aren't you, Anderson, now that's a good guy. Oh, now he's switching to the sixes, and well, oh, that's a long way off. Humphreys now, maybe the hardest thing to hit is this big one. Well, he's done that okay. Now the double four. And that's at least a point for Luke Humphreys against Gary Anderson. It is a break of throw, and Anderson's first experience, remember, of playing a contender or challenger because last year missed the Premier League, and in fact, it was his absence with the back injury that, which had he held throw, he'd have won the match. Can still win the match, but can't do it in any better than seven turns to the board, which is ridiculous. Done it again. I think he, he went for the treble 13 in the previous week with his last dart. Should have gone somewhere else, which you would have left him two darts at a double. Oh, he's going to get a dart at double five. He 
was that close again for the second year to winning a match as a challenger. Oh, Gary Anderson double ten. He can't find it. All over the place. And Luke Humphreys now is going to get another two darts, barring accidents. What's going on? Double one. Free score. You couldn't write it. Gary requires You could not make it up. For the draw. Well, that's dug a hole in the bed, and now he's missed again. Incredible scenes. One, one above, one in. That's all he needs to do. And Lou Humphries in absolutely madcap circumstances hits the madhouse and becomes the first challenger to win a match in the Premier League. The 14th attempt is a successful one and Humphries somehow, someway beats Gary Anderson in Exeter.